What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying. Um, I got a channel message in, so I decided to do this reading. It's for Cap Suicide, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you and leave the rest. Um, okay. So, um, my messages are pre-recorded right now. I felt guided, intuitively guided to do it that way. So that's what I'm doing. So just to let everybody know. And I'm in my son's room on his bunk bed. I'm not in the spirit room. So just let everybody know that too. Okay. So the channel message I received was um, someone um, very high level is about to travel to a particular city soon um, and assess the situation. They are about to be shot. They're about to go to several neighborhoods and several homes. And um, they are about to learn the real truth. That's what I heard. So you plug it in how it resonates. Partly shocked and partly not. Is what I just heard. Partly shocked and partly not. So you plug it in how it resonates. So maybe it's you that's um, going to travel. I heard, um, you're traveling to a city, I heard, whoever you are. I didn't hear who you are. Um, position, um, you're high level. You're high level. You're high level? Uh, high level. So whoever you are, you're high level. Um, and you're traveling. So you do not live in this city. It's a city. So it's a city-ionized area you're living in. I mean, not you're living in, that you're tra traveling to. Um, so it's a highly populated area. Um, and you do not live in this city that you're traveling to, whoever you are. I heard you're going to be partly shocked. So you're highly intuitive, whoever you are, high level person. Um, I wonder like high level. So I'm thinking corporate. I'm thinking, um, I'm thinking corporate. I'm thinking, um, uh, politician. I'm thinking, um, uh, manager, boss, supervisor, CEO. I'm thinking, um, Oh, who else could it be? Um, it could be um, CIA um, or um, it could be CIA or DEA or um, some kind of governmental entity agency energy or feds or marshals or something like that. Maybe you have a security clearance. That's why you're high level. Um, possibly. Um, but some kind of high level energy, whoever you are, and you do not reside in the city that you're traveling to. I heard you're going to travel to many homes, um, like neighborhoods of these homes. Um, so you, uh, there's a reason you're traveling to these neighborhoods of these homes is what I'm saying. There's a reason you're going to travel and look at these homes. Um, and it's more than one home, uh, whoever this is for. Um, obviously, you know the addresses of these homes. Um, you've given this information or you're about to be given this information of these homes, two plus homes. Um, and you're about to travel to um, these homes, uh, two plus homes in this city that you do not live in, high level person. Um, and I heard you're gonna be partly shocked. So you're highly intuitive. So I think you expected it to be this way is what I'm feeling. Um, and um, I think you partly expected it to be this way is exactly what I think. That's exactly what I think. That's exactly what I think. Yin Yang. We got this on the bottom of the deck. Already shuffled. You are going to see serious imbalances here. Because there was. Serious. Okay, I heard you're going to see serious imbalances here because there was serious. So serious imbalances. So I think it's two plus homes. So I think one home is going to be probably very, 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 very nice. And one is not. Or one is in a neighborhood. Um, maybe it's in a drug, uh, drug or crime neighborhood. Maybe it's... Um, Maybe it's run down. Maybe it's a drug home. Um, one of them is and maybe one's not. Um, however, that resonates or maybe one, it's a moderate class um, neighborhood and one, it's like a McMansion. 
Um, you plug it in how it resonates, but I heard a serious imbalance. So I think at least one home is going to be lower end um, or lowish end or moderate end, and one is going to be like a McMansion um, or two plus, however that resonates. Um, yin yang, this is the balance. I heard it's imbalanced. So the homes are imbalanced in some shape, form, or fashion. And, um, but balance is coming. I heard, but balance is coming. But balance is coming. So maybe you're going to help create this balance, possibly, person that's about to travel to visit these homes. You're a very high level person. Um, you could be Secret Service, possibly. Maybe you're Secret Service or you are the president or the vice president. I mean, I didn't hear you were, but you're high level. Um, whoever you are, I feel maybe secret service energy in here. I didn't hear that. I feel maybe. Um, maybe. Oh. This is going to be done very, very, very secretly and very soon. Okay, I heard this is going to be done very, very secretly and very soon. Holy crap. Oh, my God. So, it's going to be done very secretly and very soon. So, you high-level person, whoever you are, um, you might have people traveling with you. I didn't hear you were. You might have people traveling with you, uh, probably, especially if you're high-level. I'm sure you probably will. Um, you might, Hell, you might be so high-level, you're probably sitting in the back of the uh, limo or the back of the SUV and not even driving. Um, and I, that's kind of the energy I'm feeling here. And I'm just serious. I'm so serious about that. But I heard um, balance is coming. So I think you're going to help create the balance. Uh, number 22 could be very significant um, in your life in subject form or fashion or someone you're connected to. Number 22, it could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible jersey number, um, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Number 22, I heard balance is coming. This is the balance energy coming. Wow, this is strong. Spirit messages you have for Claudia. The garden and the gate. A particular air sign is about to pass away soon. It's going to be very, very, very significant in this. Very significant. Oh. Okay, I heard a particular air sign is about to pass away soon. It's about to be very, very, very significant. Very significant um, in this. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Air signs are Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. They could have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, North, Node, Midham, or Jupiter charts. Air sign energy about to pass away, I heard. Um, so, um... Maybe you're about to hear about this air sign passing away. I heard they're about to pass away, so it hasn't happened yet. Um, I think you're about to hear about this air sign passing away, and that's why you're about to travel to the city, um, is what I'm feeling. We have garden and the gate, so um, I think you're the key. You're the key. You're the key to unlock the gate and the knowledge of this when you travel to the city and see these homes and this imbalance situation. Um, that's what I'm feeling. Let me go get my kipper. I'll be right back. Okay, sorry. Oh. Okay, yeah. And I haven't shuffled them. I just got them off the table just like this in my spirit room. But look what I got on the bottom of the deck. Journey. You're about to journey. You're about to journey to the city, high-level person or people. I'm feeling secret service energy in here, and I'm serious. You're about to journey. You're about to travel to this city that you do not reside in. Um, and tens are completions of cycles. So I think a huge cycle has completed and ended for you to travel to this um, city to view these homes and neighborhoods and assess the situation. This is exactly what I think, whoever you are. 
Um, it's all over the place in here, the messages and the cards. Traveling, completions of cycles. A huge cycle has completed. Okay, I heard a huge cycle has completed. So a huge cycle has completed. That's confirmation uh, from the spiritual realm with the 10 and the journey card. Um, whoever you are, high-level person. I've been pulling in a lot of high-level energy in here recently, a lot. Come on, baby. Come here. Come on. Heard an air sign's about to pass away soon. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Um, I'm assuming it's an adult um, that's about to pass away. Um, they could have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, Moon, and Hemorrhage, Jupiter, Charts. I didn't hear how they're going to pass away, but somehow them passing away soon is going to be significant in this. Uh, maybe it's going to prompt you to travel, or maybe you're going to travel before they pass away. Everybody's on a different time of life pass, so you plug it in how it resonates. Uh, number five could be a very significant number in your life in some shape or form fashion. It could be a possible age of a child of yours or somebody you're connected to, a possible date of birth number, possible lottery number, possible social security card number, possible green card number. Number five, mature man. You are going to be very emotional when you see the truth of this situation. And you're going to really, really help in huge ways. Oh my gosh, so you plug it in, how it resonates. I heard you're going to be very, very emotional when you see the truth of the situation. So I think the truth of the homes, the truth of the neighborhoods, the truth in the imbalance in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, and I heard you're going to be very emotional and it's going to um, cause you to help um, in huge ways. So um, you're, you're mature. You're mature. Uh, whether you're a masculine energy or you're a femme taking on masculine energy. I strongly feel you might be a masculine energy. Um, or like I said, you could be a femme taking on heavy masculine, but I, I feel for a lot of whoever you are, high level person, you, I feel you might be a masculine energy or a femme taking on heavy masculine, but you plug it in how it resonates. Um, but a lot of emotional energy is going to be had once you see this with your own eyeballs. Um, and you get confirmation in the real physical 3d world, whoever you are, masculine or heavy or femme that takes on heavy masculine, but you do not reside in the city, whoever you are. Um, you don't. So you plug it in how it resonates. Let's pull a card. Let me close it. Another air sign is getting a huge, huge, huge wake up call. Huge. And a water sign. Okay, I heard an, um, another air sign and a water sign is getting a huge, huge wake up call. So um, air signs are Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and water signs are Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. You could have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, Node, Manhattan, or Jupiter charts. Um, you're getting a huge wake-up call, air sign or water sign energy, whoever you are. Family room reverse, number 21 could be very significant. It could be a possible age of viewers somebody you're connected to, possible date of birth number, possible lottery number, possible jersey number, um, possible green card number, number 21, family room reverse. Someone preyed on someone's happiness in the past. And it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. Some with the death energy. Some exposure. Oh my God. Whoa. Holy shit. So you plug it in how it resonates. Oh my God. Heard someone preyed on someone's happiness uh, in the past. And it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. Some with the death and some um, with exposure. And we have bad health on the bottom of the deck. Now, number 31 could be very significant in someone's life. It could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to. Possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible jersey number, possible green card number, number 31, bad health. I'm thinking this is the person that's about to pass away. Heard someone preyed on someone. So they were very opportunistic, narcissistic energy. It reminds me of Secret 7 situation. 
I didn't hear Secret Seven specifically in here, but it surely reminds me of that. And because um, they preyed on that family, they preyed on the family, the single mother and her children. They just preyed and used and abused the hell out of that family until they couldn't get any more. Um, and now they live very luxurious life, luxurious lifestyles because of it, and it's really sad. Um, but um, I, I think the air sign is the one that pray, um, prayed. They prayed. I think they uh, prayed and now they're about to pay for it energetically with their life is what I'm feeling. I mean, I didn't hear any of that. That's just what I'm feeling. So bad health. Um, this is the bad health of this air sign about to pass away. Heard it's about to be very significant in this. Um, it could be a masculine or femme air sign. I didn't hear age on the air sign. Um, they could have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Warp, Nomad, Hammer, Jupiter charts. Um, it's all in the cards and the messages in here. Bad health, air sign about to pass away. It's about to be very significant. Expectation, judication on the bottom of the deck. Number 30 or 28 could be very significant numbers in your life in some shape, form, or fashion. 30 or 28. Possible ages of you or somebody you're connected to. Possible lottery number. Possible date of birth number. Possible jersey number. Possible uh, green card number. Reoccurring numbers you're seeing out on billboards, advertisements, 28 or 30. Wow. Expectation. Someone expected someone to do the right thing in the past and they did not. Now it's about to boomerang energetically on them. Soon. Death. Death. Oh my God. Oh my God. Whoa. Somebody's about to pass away. And Arizona's about to pass away. And I am just being serious about this. I didn't hear how they're going to pass away. I did not hear the details. But dear God Almighty. Um, they, they were, um, I think you high level person expected them to do the right thing in the past. Whoever you are, you have expectation upright, high level person. We're all about you, high level person in here. Um, you expected them to do the right thing in the past, but I heard they didn't. And now they're about to pay for their, with their life through the universe. And maybe that's what you're getting the huge wake up call about air sign and water sign energy over here is that this air sign in the past did not do the right thing in the past. They didn't do the right thing in the past. I think you might have known they didn't do the right thing in the past, but I, maybe you didn't know they were going to pass away soon. But I heard, my gosh, double confirmation from this reading. Two times I've heard they're about to pass away. And we had bad health upright. They're about to pass away. Now, I don't know how you can pass away a million different ways in the universe. ODs, motor vehicle accidents, traumatic uh, instances, shooting, stabbings, um, uh, uh, somebody poisoning your ass, uh, arson, uh, a million different ways you can pass away in the universe. But they're about to pass away, whoever this air sign is. They were expected, you high-level person or somebody expected them to do the right thing in the past. I heard they did not. And they're about to pay for it with their life. Um, and maybe that's one of the reasons you're traveling to the city. Maybe you're coming to the funeral or maybe you're traveling to the city before they pass away. You have to plug in your life how it fits, high-level person. Number 30, um, adjudication. In fact, they didn't do anything. They did the opposite. Of the right thing. There are people in legal matters right now. That they should not be in right. Be in currently in the universe. To try to cover up their wrongdoings of the past. But it's about to backfire in a huge way. Oh my god. This is terrible. Okay. So I heard this air sign did nothing but the right thing basically. Whoever this air sign is to you, high-level person, they did nothing but the right thing. They did everything but the right thing, basically. Um, and I heard they're about to pay for it with their life. I mean, it could be COVID. It could, I'm sorry, C-19. It could be um, 
uh, exacerbated illness. I mean, I don't know. There's a millions way, millions of ways one could pass away is what I'm trying to say. But however that resonates, this air sign, I heard they did nothing but the right thing. So they did everything but the right thing. Um, it sounds like they're a position of high authority, or they were. And I'm just being serious because they are in some kind of position to do the right thing. But the, I heard they did everything but the right thing. So everything but the right thing, basically. Um, and they're about to pay for it with their life. Um, I heard they have people in court situations right now they should not be in. Uh, that they should not be in. They are current. So they created some kind of situation to create a. I heard it, they put them in the court situation to try to cover up basically their wrongdoings but it's about to backfire um on them but i think it's about to energetically backfire on them with them losing their life and i'm serious about that i just don't know how to say that i'm serious because i heard it's about to backfire on them they have intentionally put i heard several people in court situations right now to try to cover up their mistakes that they made in the past and then they put these poor people in court situations um so i wonder if they're profiting off these court situations by putting, maybe they work in the legal sector, the air sign does, possibly, maybe, I'm not, I didn't hear they did, but they might work in the legal sector, because somehow, are they intentionally put these people in air, um, in legal situations to cover up their wrongdoings of the past, so I, I, they, I think they start, start drama or created kind of, some kind of series of chain of events to put them in the court situations to cover up and slow down something, to cover up their wrongdoings is what I'm trying to say, that's exactly what I'm feeling from the messages, but you take it how it resonates. Um, so they might work in the legal sector. They might profit off of this court situations, court battles. They might be a lawyer. They might be a judge. They might be paralegal. They might work in the legal sector. Um, they, or they might be a social worker. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. You have to plug in how it resonates. I didn't hear the occupation of the air sign. Um, or, yeah, I didn't hear the occupation, but somehow them finagling and stirring up crap and putting people in um, whatever occupation they're in, um, putting people in court situations to tie them up energetically, to tie their money up and their time up and um, to get their stress levels going, being in the middle of court situations is benefiting um, or they were trying to benefit them by trying to cover something up. But I heard it's about to backfire. I think it's about to backfire with their life. Heard somebody's about to pass away. I mean, that's the biggest form of going out, period, is passing away. I mean, you just cannot, um, you can't come back from passing away. I mean, unless, well, um, well, CPR saves lives, yes. But, I mean, I'm just saying, we got bad health again. Holy God. High honor. This high-level person is about to turn things around in huge, huge, huge ways. Huge. About to give the true person high honor that deserves it. Family. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. Wow. Okay, so whoever you are, high-level person, ma'am or sir, you're, you're wonderful, whoever you are, um, whoever you are. Heard you're about to turn this around in a huge way. You're about to give the uh, family a uh, high honor that deserves it, finally. So it sounds like a family deserves high honor from the past and they never got it in some shape, form, or fashion is what I'm feeling um, from the messages, the spiritual downloads. That's what I'm feeling. Um, and um, you're about to travel to this city, look, assess the situation, see it with your own eyeballs, see the real truth. And then it sounds like you're going to give this family, it's a family. So it, it could be a single parent family um, or um, a blended family or a um, married couple family or committed partner family with children. They have children. I'm feeling it could be Secret 7. If it is, it's single mom Leo and her children, um, possibly. But you plug it in how it resonates. But um, high honor upright, um, true high honor. Because I heard they deserved it in the past and never got it. But it's because this air sign did everything but the right thing, basically. And I heard the air sign's about to pay for it with their life. So um, you plug it in how it resonates. This is so strong. Bad health on the bottom of the deck. I was wait I was trying to see if I was going to get the death card out. But I didn't. But this is what we got. So 
All right, you guys. Well, I love you guys. I hope this helped and namaste.